It feels like the games are just going to keep coming as we go into this holiday season. This is a record-setting couple of weeks for releases on the Switch. Buckle up for a long and sometimes weird ride. October 16th sees the highly anticipated... So that's what we're doing this week? Lying to our viewers? Some people enjoy this series from Game Mechanic Studios, and now fans of Big Buck Hunter Arcade can play it on Switch. Enjoy 45 hunting levels, 7 bonus games, and local multiplayer. Survive dangerous animal encounters to earn your spot on the online leaderboards. Lock and load for $29.99 at retail. Also on the 16th from Climax Studios and Outright Games is Crayola Scoot. Show your true colors in this scooter game as you paint the town red, or blue, or green, or pink, or whatever other color you want. The gameplay is reminiscent of an early Tony Hawk game as you perform tricks and jumps for points and activate hidden boosts and shortcuts, all the while splashing your color everywhere. You can even upgrade your scooter as you progress through the game. The game supports four-player local multiplayer if you want to challenge your friends. There are multiple modes, including a splat tag survive mode and crazy crayons, a race through the skate park to collect the crayons. Crayola Scoot retails for $39.99. Zoink Games has you playing as Penny, a recently deceased girl who takes on the role of the Grim Reaper in Flipping Death. Use her new powers to help guide souls into the afterlife, all the while jumping between the world of life and death to try to discover the mystery surrounding your own demise. Flipping Death hits stores October 18th for $29.99. TT Games and WB Games are at it again with the latest in the LEGO game series. LEGO DC Supervillains puts you on the side of evil as the Justice League have been taken out of the picture. Customize your character to the extreme and join the mean team. In typical LEGO style, you can break nearly everything into pieces, solve the puzzles, and make your characters work together to unlock the secrets of the game. For those of you who are Steelbook fans, grab the Deluxe Edition, which will also include a season pass and early access to the TV series character pack. The Steelbook Edition retails for $74.99, while the Standard Edition retails for $59.99. If you felt like the Toys to Life market needed some rejuvenation, then Ubisoft is answering your pleas with Starlink Battle for Atlas. On October 16th, mix and match ships, pilots, wings, and weapons as you explore seven alien planets in the Atlas star system. If you're buying physically, and why would you not, the Switch Starter Pack is the only way to get the physical R-Wing and Fox McCloud. It's going to cost you $74.99, but that is one nice collector's piece. The final game on the 16th is Warriors Orochi 4 from Koei Tecmo. If you enjoy warrior-style games, you're in for a treat. Magic powers will be introduced to the series. There are over 170 characters available in this game from the Samurai Warriors and Dynasty Warriors universes, including five new characters, the gods Zeus, Athena, Ares, Perseus, and Odin. Warriors Orochi 4 brings online multiplayer to the series for the first time. If you pre-order, you get two bonus mounts and three bonus costumes. And if you purchase before November 12th, there are seven additional bonus costumes available. Pick this up for $59.99. Oh, and one last note for the 16th. Candle, Power of the Flame got moved back to this date. We covered that in our last video, so we'll move on to the next one. It's looking like October 19th is going to be when Bandai Namco finally brings From Software's painfully unforgiving RPG Dark Souls Remastered to the Switch. Some might want to make sure they have some backup Joy-Cons because this game can be rage inducing. You'll be collecting souls and lighting bonfires for $39.99 at retail. Praise the sun. Praise the sun. No puns for this fishing game this time around. On the 23rd of October, Bass Pro Shops and Planet Entertainment bring Bass Pro Shops The Strike Championship Edition to the Switch. Hit up the shop for all the equipment you need, then get out on the lake to reel in the fish. If you really want to feel a bit more of the genuine experience, grab the bundle, which includes a fishing rod peripheral for your Joy-Cons. The standard edition is $39.99, while the bundle is only $10 more at $49.99. Solutions to Go has decided the Switch needed a second hunting game in October, so they're bringing Cabela's The Hunt Championship Edition to stores on October 23rd. Multiple game modes, a variety of equipment, and epic prey set in a realistic environment are staples of this genre. But this hunting game does offer something the others don't. You can buy the game alone for $39.99, but if you want more immersion, the $49.99 bundle includes a Bullseye Pro peripheral. As an extra fun fact, you can actually buy this from Bass Pro Shop if you want to. 
Get your groove on with Just Dance 2019 from Ubisoft on the 23rd. This will be the third Just Dance title to hit the switch in under two years. It's packed with 40 dance tracks that you and up to five of your friends can jam to. This game was Ubisoft's opening act during E3, and now you can be that dancing panda. Just Dance 2019 will waltz away with $39.99 from your wallet. Game Mill is going buck wild with their licensing by bringing SpongeBob, Patrick, Sandy, Leonardo, Raphael, Michelangelo, Donatello, Arnold, Helga, Angelica, Tommy, and Reptar to the Switch and Nickelodeon Kart Racers on October 23rd. If you felt like the Switch needed more kart racers, you're not not wrong, but you're getting this one for $39.99 anyway. Also on the 23rd is Party Arcade from Planet Entertainment. This compilation of party games brings popular favorites like ping pong, skee ball, cornhole, air hockey, and more to a virtual arcade where you can play with up to four players either locally or online. At the time of recording, it looks like this one's not available from Best Buy, so you'll have to look at Amazon or GameStop if you're planning on picking it up. Party Arcade is retailing for $29.99. Paw Patrol on a Roll by Taurus Games and Outright Games has you completing 16 rescue missions across 8 locations around Adventure Bay. This puzzle platformer hits shelves October 23rd for $39.99 and is exclusive to Walmart. No job is too big, no pup is too small, and remember, if you're in trouble, just yelp for help. Your son watches Paw Patrol, doesn't he? <laughs> How'd you guess? Rapala Fishing Pro Series from Game Mill Entertainment isn't just the second fishing game on the list, it's the second fishing game to come out on the same day. Honestly, once you've covered one fishing game, you've covered them all. Rapala Fishing Pro Series retails for $29.99. World Neverland, Elnia Kingdom from Althe Inc. is an RPG sim title getting a physical release in Japan on October 25th. Immigrate into an imaginary kingdom and interact with the people living there. The story is as different as you make it every time you play through. The physical edition of this game from the World Neverland series comes with a bonus White Wing series of equipment and will cost 4,600 yen. It can't be true. I think it might actually be. Huh. Imagine that. Chicken Range from NYX Digital and Funbox Media is finally coming out. I placed my original order for this game on the 10th of September. That wasn't that long ago of 2017. In Chicken Range, the chickens walk or run across the screen while you shoot at them with a reticle that you move around. Eventually, they throw eggs at your screen. Why would they throw their unborn children at you? After watching more footage of the game, it really doesn't get much better. I suppose if you get bored, and you will, you could play their version of Flappy Bird. You can import this gem for a mere £19.99. Bandai Namco brings another fighter to the Switch with My Hero 1's Justice on October 26th. This 3D arena fighter features a cast from the popular manga and anime series that is its namesake, and allows you to create unique teams while customizing your appearance with unlockable accessories. Become the world's number one hero or villain by taking on opponents online and climbing the leaderboards. Pick this one up for $59.99. I don't know about you, but I can't wait to play Chicken Range, or... Paw Patrol, or the fishing games, or yet another cart game, or ridiculously priced simulator game that's free on mobile, or one of the hunting games, or Splatoon on Wheels, or Just Dance 9072, or Virtual Beer Pong. Wow, this lineup is generally terrible. If you're a discerning buyer, you've got a lot of crap to dodge these couple of weeks. They're not all sleepers, but some are definitely worth waiting for a sale. But what you don't want to wait on is subscribing to this channel so you don't miss out on any of our other videos or the podcast. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>